All right, let's do a draft spotlight. Let's kick it off with uh, Zach Wilson. Hit that subscribe button, bell icon button, share the video. If you got any uh, draft spotlight ideas, hit me up on Twitter. Um, that link's in the description on Facebook. I'm never on Instagram, so um, let me know. Check out Detroit Lions Talk playlist. I'm mean, excuse me, the draft spotlight playlist. And um, I see why you know people like him as the top, a second quarterback taken. Um, arm strength is, is really good. Um, accurate down the field, um, mobile. Um, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna say he the most. I mean, out of the four quarterbacks, it's probably out of the five quarterbacks, it's probably gonna go in the first two rounds. I think uh, he's probably the, the one that I might. His mobility might not be the most mobile. I think Justin Fields, Trevor Lawrence. I'm not sure with Trey Lance, but I'm sure what I've seen a little bit. I've seen he a little bit more mobile. Trash, Ellinger, seem to be more mobile than him, but um, yeah, he got an arm. You know, I'm not sure he's gonna fall to us, or we gonna move up and get him. But if we did really like Zach Wilson, we do, we do have the assets to go get him. Um, strong arm, solid mobility. Um, seem to put, seem to got good accuracy. Put the ball where it need to go. When you think about kind of the New York Jets for a minute, and you say, oh well, you know, where would they look to go? Let's say they go to quarterback. Is he really an upgrade from Sam Darnold? Um, or unless you believe that you wrecked Sam Darnold, you wrecked his confidence, then, you know, I understand there. If you feel like you wrecked Sam Darnold's confidence, then, you know, I get you with Zach Wilson. But do they feel that they're in a position to say, you know what, we we in position not to make the same mistake. We got the offensive line. We got the weapons. We're Bashar Breeland is a free agent. Um, we got a good defense. I just think I'm, – I'm, I don't think they're in a position where they have the structure – I don't think they got the structure to bring another quarterback in. I think if you put Zach Wilson in that situation and he not head and shoulders and knees and toes above Sam Darnold, you're just going to wreck another quarterback. Then what's going to start happening, what's going to happen to them is that, you know, elite quarterbacks that come out and say, I don't want to play for the New York Jets. Look what happened to Sam Darnold. Look what happened to Zach Wilson. I think they are in a position to take that off as a lineman from Oregon or a receiver to help out Sam Donald. And um that's that's just that's just my opinion. You know, when you look at when you look at that team, that, that team is gonna do the same thing as unless Zach Wilson is really, really special. You know, Tom Peyton Manning type special. It's just gonna be the same thing over and over again. When you look behind them, the Dolphins are not gonna take a quarterback. They're gonna trade. I don't see why they take why New York would take a quarterback. I don't think, I mean, it don't make sense. Then you look at Miami. Don't need a, so then you look at the Atlanta Falcons. They need a quarterback, possibly, but they still ain't got rid of Mac Ryan. So right now, it don't look like it. The Bengals don't need a quarterback. The Eagles rumored to take a quarterback. But that, so it could be a situation where, you know, somebody had to move up and get Zach Wilson. Because it, it, doesn't, it doesn't make no sense. They haven't made a decision on Sam Darnold. You bring in... You bring in Zach Wilson. Is he better than Sam Darnold coming up? I don't know. Mobility is around the same. Maybe Wilson got a little stronger arm. But and also with Wilson, you know, his level of opposition. You know? His you know, he had a lot of throws. I look at the scout film where he had, you know, where he made tight throws, but what about the pass rushers? What about there's questions about him? They say, Oh, he's a franchise quarterback, and I look, he hasn't played at the highest level. You know, that's my issue at it. He ain't played at the highest level. Most of his throws to the same guy, so I'm not sure he's better than Justin Fields, and I haven't seen Trey Lance, you know. So, you know, strong arm kid, you know, average mobility, you know, for the NFL today, which is Josh Allen, you know, you know uh, Lamar Jackson. So it's good to be our average Aaron Rodgers. When I look at his arm, it's good, but the, the is he going to be able to deal with the, the tight windows, anticipating windows, um, you know, is he going to be able to deal with the speed of the NFL? Not sure, but I think he's a solid quarterback prospect. If he fought us, I think we'd be lucky to have him. But, hey, let me know what you guys think about him. Don't forget me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You can reach out if you have a business question, call, response, or video request. All our social media links in the description. The fastest way to reach me is Twitter, then Facebook, then Instagram. Facebook group link in the description. Want to make a financial donation? Cash app, CJ good 313 That's in the description. PayPal link there as well, too. That's what a donate. Share, share video. Appreciate the love support. We're done.